Hi guys, my name is Naroda. Welcome to my channel. I hope you guys, guys can hear me. Um, I'm a little bit windy. That's because I just pumped up this bad boy with my 4500 HPA uh, pump um, up to 2000 PSI. So I'm a little bit out of breath. Um, regardless, this is my bullpup. Um, I know some of you have been following me on Instagram. Um, and you've been waiting for a chance to see this in action. Um, I have promised to you guys to show you a firing demonstration last Saturday. Uh, unfortunately, I took the blaster to the games, but I made a big mistake um, with servicing my core, and that's I put in the wrong lubrication. Don't do that, guys, because it will cease to work. Um, I sorted it now, I took it apart, put in the right stuff, and it should all be working fine right now. Um, currently it has a uh, talon mag in, Jesus, it has a talon mag in and these are the ACC Gen 3 darts. Um, these tend to feed very, very well in this type of blaster with this type of breech. Um, workers Gen 3, they work as well, uh, I will show you later, um, but these work best. Um, so what are we looking at here? This is a HPA bullpup. Inside here right now is a super core. Um, it's intended to house a sniper core in the future. The one Liam uh, from Bang Spectre uh, Armaments uh, and myself are working on currently to develop. Um, but right now, as that one's not finished yet, um, it has a, a super core inside, which works really well. Um, it's just that it's a normally closed breach and it opens upon firing, whereas the sniper core will be the opposite and it will only close once you fire. Um, two benefits in that. Um, one, you can always take out the mag. And secondly, it's way more air efficient than this core because this one tends to lose some of its pressure um, when the breach is already opening. Um, sniper core will have all its air exiting through the barrel. Okay, enough talk. Um, I know you guys are here to see it fire. Um, it has the uh, ASA relay on off, um, it's currently not pressurized, as soon as I do flip it, the breech will close, I will show you, there you go, so it's now live, um, and I will turn on, uh, there we go, turn on the holo sight, and I don't know if you can see this, I'll back off a little bit so the camera can adjust, but right there in the back, in the middle of the screen, there's a pillow on a chair, it's about seven and a half, eight meters away from me, so it's not a really difficult target to hit. I'll try and hit it anyway. Let's see how it goes, right? There you go. That was all the ACCs, 15 rounds in one go. Now we'll go for the worker ones. Open the breech. Put in the mag, close the breech. Let's have a go. There you go. It just jammed on me. That's what workers tend to do. Um, I'll have to unjam it now. I'll show you how that goes as well. Why not? There we go. Take a jam rod. And that's what happens with the workers. They just don't feed that easily and it's due to the tip. <laughs> Having said that, my recommendation 100% if you want to run a super core in a blaster like this, be it my bullpup or Liam's HDHD, please use ACC darts or any other darts with a dome tip. They will much easier go into your feeding system. All right, so that's it for today. I'm sorry for being so out of breath and for losing my words every now and then. I'm not used to doing stuff like this. Um, perhaps you'll see more of it in the future. Uh, I hope so anyway. Um, it's been nice 
meeting you now for the first time face to face. I hope you agree and uh, I hope to bring you much more cool stuff in the future. Please stay tuned for that. Thanks. I'm out.